I'm Betty. And we're the, the Smith, Smith sisters. sisters. Today we are here uh, to make, um, share with you a, a family casserole that serves us well and, and it's so easy and good to do for other people too and sometimes when you feel like you need to take a little something. It could be a nice thing, I think, Betty, uh, after the rich ham or the rich turkey and the rich standing rib roast of the holidays, yes. to make a big old vat of and serve your family while they're in and out. Yes, and it, after you've made it, if you decide, no, today's not it, it can freeze very well. So, and you can bring it out at a later date. So you could make it before the holiday, bring it out after the holiday. Suzanne, tell us how this casserole came about because it's very simple. Uh, yeah, it's simple and it has an ingredient that some people will probably raise their eyebrows. But uh, my mother-in-law, Alice Branch, it, it was a favorite of hers and she would make it for friends and people, maybe somebody a little under the weather. And uh, so when she was uh, not well toward the end of her life, the uh, Genesee County uh, Medical Auxiliary was putting together a, a cookbook and she wasn't able to do any recipes, but my father-in-law wanted recipes of hers in it. And so I put this one in along with a couple others that I can't quite remember. But so this has been a long time favorite of ours. And as I said, it serves us well and, and uh, it's gonna be tasty, I think you'll find. I think you'll find it's very good. Yeah, well- My family loves it. Yeah, they do love it and it stretches and and, um, and the more it cooks, the, the better, better it is. becomes. Right. Okay, Betty, I think we should get at it, don't yep. you? Let's, do Let's it. go. Beginning the casserole, we've browned a pound of ground beef, and Betty's adding it to a casserole dish. And we also have a green pepper and onion that we've sauteed, and we'll mix that in with the meat. And then we'll get our Secret ingredient yeah, are, which is Campbell's spaghetti. Used to be uh, Franco American. Franco American, then Campbell's bought Franco American. And I want you to know this is not the simplest thing to find any longer. It hasn't you, been during this COVID. And you can find SpaghettiOs all day long, but this good old oh, tomato, tomato and cheese spaghetti is a little bit harder to find or it has been for us. So anyway, we're gonna, you give it a mix, Betty. We're using three cans of, of this today. You think we'll need three? I guess Oh, we'll maybe, do maybe, do you think two will do it today? Well, let's look at it after we get it. It takes a little mixing together to get the noodles to meet the ground beef. And maybe not. What do you think? Oh, that's all right. Um, now, uh, and now we're going to add uh, some spaghetti sauce. And in this batch, because it's a small, we're going to add about a half a, a, a bottle of Prego here. You can also add mushrooms, and I also add a can of kidney beans. Some people don't like kidney beans, so anyway, we're, we're leaving those out today, but uh, we're good to go here, Betty. And actually, then we're going to add some Parmesan cheese. Do you mix yours in or put it on top, Betty? I mix it yeah. in and then I put it on top. Oh my gosh, it's rolling right out of this little container in ball form. You want to take the wheel. Mm -hmm. So we've used just two cans of spaghetti today. There's no, and I think you get the idea that you just can't really go wrong. Um, so we'll... Did you put all the sauce in? I put the sauce all in. Do you think you need more? I put, go ahead and empty that on top. There we go. And she's ready to go, what, at 350? 350, well, 350 if you're gonna serve it within the next couple hours. If you cook it low and slow, 300 degrees for three or four hours, it's the best it is. Yeah. The longer it cooks, the more that stuff soaks in. And just bubbles up. Bubbles right turns up. Turns into goodness. 
So that's our family casserole, the one we recommend that will make everyone in your family and your friends happy. A, a simple little ditty that you can uh, you pull out anytime you want to. We hope you enjoy it. Yes. It's a nice cold weather dish. Day right. Dish. Right. And it's a nice hot weather day dish. Yes. So any time of the year. Okay. We hope you enjoy it. I'm Betty. I'm Sue and we're, we're the, the Smith, Smith sisters. sisters.